Have you ever found yourself wondering if God really protects those who love Him? I've gone through seasons of opposition where difficulties seem to just keep coming and coming, and I've cried out, God, when will you intervene? When will you step in to protect me? But it's in those moments that I'll pause and remind myself that God protects in many ways. Just a few quick examples. There's his rerouting protection, where he'll remove you from a place or someone else from being in proximity to you for a specific reason. There's his sustaining protection, where he'll strengthen and uphold you by his grace through that thing that will ultimately prune and prepare you for his best that's on the other side of it. There's his miraculous intervention protection, hallelujah, we all love that kind, right? The examples go on and on from there, of course. But I bet if you step outside of the specific way that you've decided that God should be protecting you, you'll realize that your victorious warrior, your faithful father, your attentive shepherd has already stepped into your situation in numerous ways. Psalm 46 1 says, God is your refuge and strength, your ever present help in trouble. 2 Thessalonians 3 verse 3 says, the Lord is faithful. He will establish you and guard you. Psalm 138 7 says, though I walk in the midst of trouble, you preserve my life. You stretch out your hand against the anger of my foes and with your right hand you save me. I trust that the truth of his word will hit your heart right where you are in a personal way as we go to the Lord together in prayer. Thank you, God, that you do protect us in every sorrow and every joy. Help us to discern your nearness and to grow in a sensitivity to your voice. Fortify our ability to grow through the tough things, knowing that you are in the fire with us each step of the way. In Jesus' holy name I pray, amen.